Hi, I'm Anna Ariano. Um, well, what can I say? I'm going to miss everybody. Well, not everybody, but you know, first sergeant, sergeant major, colonel. They all helped me and everything. Um, what's it called? Well, first sergeant's like a dad to me. I don't know. I don't know what else to say. Um, well, my freshman year, believe it or not, my freshman year, I'd skip every day this class. They'll never get on me, but then after that, I just came to RTC every day, all day. I never thought I was going to be a company commander or even a first sergeant because the way I acted in freshman year, but hey, look at me now. I'm a company commander. Um, this program really helped me change my attitude towards everything and everyone. I'm more mature. I have, I've been having a job since I was 14, helped my mom. Um, and I'm sorry, I'm blank. Uh, it, it's nerve wracking. Um, but yeah, um, I'm not gonna cry either. Um, but. Um, Giggity. <laughs> no. Tell us, tell us some stuff that you miss. Oh, I'm gonna miss all the instructors. They are really cool and funny, especially the Colonel. He's really funny. But I'll try and come back and visit. I'm not sure I will stay here in Florida. I'm probably gonna go back to Kansas. But when I have time, I'm gonna come and visit them. Sure. <laughs> but yeah, so I don't know what else to say. What else should I say? Bonjour, je m'appelle Alexia Boulay. C'est ma quatrième année dans ce programme. Et je voulais remercier tout le monde pour cette quatrième super année. Et vous allez tous me manquer. Puis à bientôt. That's a Morris Cooper. This is my fourth year in ROTC. It's been one hell of a ride from what, like getting yelled at to raiders all over the place. The instructors here, I have to thank a lot. I owe a lot of dedication, a lot of influential values that I earned from them. So I have to say thank you for that. And uh, keep it up. All of you graduate, make great moves. So. It's recording. Oh, it's recording now? All right. Um, <laughs> first of all, I just want to say thank you to Colonel because Colonel was the one that influenced me to join ROTC. And if he didn't, then I don't know what I would have did in high school. Second of all, I want to thank Sergeant Major because Sergeant Major knows me oh so well. And he's the one that got me good at drill, put me on the drill team. And I've just been rocking and rolling ever since then. First, Sergeant. Oh, man. I know we've had our differences many, many times, but all in all, you're right. You do look out for us when we want, when we need something. You're there. You give it to us. And honestly, I don't know what I would do if I was in ROTC right now. And the three of you have helped me ever since I joined ROTC. You made high school fun for me. You made things so fun and exciting. The fundraisers we do, I done said fun like at least a hundred times already in this video. My God, I drew out how many times I said fun. Oh, man. Ooh. But, um, ROTC is like the best thing ever in high school. Especially when you have great SAIs and AIs like Colonel First Sergeant, Sergeant Major, and it's just oh, man. I'm gonna miss you guys when I leave. I'm like, I don't, I don't want to leave. I do want to leave, but I don't want to leave. It's like, I'm just ranting now. I'm just like talking. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm just saying thank you. Thank you is all I can say. It's not all I can say, but it's the most, it's just the most important thing I can say right now. It's thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Colonel, first sergeant, sergeant major. I love all of you. And without you guys, then I wouldn't, be, I wouldn't be right here right now. I wouldn't be who I am right this, right this second at this time. And man. I am. I think I'm done. I think I'm done. I don't think I'm done. I probably am done. You know what? I think I'm done. All right. Ugh. RTC has changed me in many ways from when I first joined. 
I first came in thinking that everyone had their like little cliques and everyone in ROTC had to join the military and it was very structured and uptight. But soon I realized that that's not the case at all. Um, I'd like to thank First Sergeant for always pushing me to doing things that I never would have pushed myself to do when it comes to anything physical or mental or emotional. We talk about feelings every morning, which is something I never did before I came in here. Um, I'd also like to thank Sergeant Major for being my black daddy. <laughs> He's the only black daddy I ever had. <laughs> and I'd like to thank my granddaddy, Colonel, for always treating me like a princess and saying hello to me in the hallway and just telling really good stories all the time. <laughs> Even if they were really off topic. Like, <laughs> um, after high school, I would, am now really prepared. And I probably wouldn't know what I was going to be doing if it weren't for ROTC because First Sergeant was on our butts about this, like, every single day. It was a grade for us to do assignments to get our future ready. And now I'm joining the Air Force, which is something out of this world. When I was, like, five years old, I wanted to be a librarian. And now I'm going to be in the Air Force. It's kind of crazy. Um, I also used to... <laughs> I can't do it without laughing. <laughs> There's just <clears throat> a lot of funny things. Um, first sergeant woke us up in the rifle range at 3 a.m. one time to go to Raider Meet, and I would have never done that unless he made me do that, which was kind of annoying. I'm kind of ranting now. Um, just to sum it up, I feel like ROTC is one big family, and it's something I don't really have. So coming into school every day, Seeing everybody laughing, joking around, doing whatever, they pretty much accept you for who you are. And that's the biggest thing that I've learned is no matter what you're doing, no matter where you are in life, you can always be accepted by a group of people and get a job done. And that's what ROTC has taught me. And I'm a princess. So <laughs> no, that's all I got. Are we still going to do this? <laughs> do you want to say bye? Courtney Burns. Um, ROTC has like helped me and changed me. I think I have more patience because of ROTC. This my ninth grade year. Uh, let's just say I wasn't so patient. I had a few hash outs, still do, with first sergeant, but that's normal. Who, do, who doesn't have a hash out with him? Everyone does. Um, I can honestly say that I feel like I'm as a person and that Colonel has always like been the one that like made me smile and stuff especially when I was in the mood like you know sometimes I don't know I just have that demeanor where it's like I don't want to be bothered and Colonel comes over and it's the random thing ever and he'll say something and it's, but it's funny though um I feel like I'm gonna miss ROTC. Um, I miss having the discipline. And I hope things will go back to the way it was my ninth grade year. Where they have more discipline. But that's it. The last four years of JRTC has been so awesome. Uh, I wanna shout out to my white daddy, first sergeant, to Colonel the old Mac daddy. And Uncle Sergeant Major Brady White Whitehead. Uh, these past four years has been awesome. Can't ask for a better four years in JRTC. But how you do that there? Because I ain't your babysitters. That's it. Jennifer Goolsby. Uh, I liked ROTC a lot. Came here my 10th grade year and it was like a big happy family. Um, I'm gonna miss Colonel, First Sergeant, and Sergeant Major. This program really helped me a lot and helped me be less shy. And it was
was really fun. More? <laughs> like, add some things to it. I know you don't, I know you, you put Hedra's first out occasionally. Bring mm -hmm. that in. Yeah. Like, how, how, like, to be completely honest, like, okay. of what happened. We're starting. Um. When I first got here, I thought our sergeant was, like, kind of mean, but he's really nice to me anyways. And Colonel is very nice, and I appreciate everything all of you guys did. Sergeant Major, gonna miss you. Joking around with me and my little brother. Um, yeah. I'm Jamari Graham. I joined JROTC in the ninth grade. Uh, JROTC has helped me become a better person, a better leader, and helped me aspire to be for long term leadership positions. Um, I'm going to miss the first sergeants, sergeant major and colonel. They've been really big role models to me uh, throughout my high school career. They've also inspired me to uh, get my education and go into the Army faster than what I was originally planning, but that'll help me along my way of getting my four-star general ranking, hopefully one day. Uh, what I miss about the program is having a direct impact on the younger cadets and uh, helping them to be better than what they could have been. That's it. My name is Shalia Harris, and I just want to say JRTC has a big impact on my life. And it made me have a different outlook on things and how I look at things, and it also changed my attitude about things. Um, I'm really going to miss playing ghetto kickball <laughs> with Colonel, and I will never forget what Colonel did for me. It meant a lot to me. And I also thank Sergeant Major for pushing me and making me realize that anything is possible in life. And I also thank First Sergeant for pushing me also and letting me know how good that I have come and what progress that I have made throughout my years in ROTC. I haven't been there that long. I did my two and a half years and I've learned a lot and it has made me look at things different and it changed my attitude and I hope that it changed yours too. Hey everyone, I'm Anik. Um, ROTC for me would be a step forward from where I was because I wasn't really like an ideal student or someone popular. So, like, ROTC taught me to be more self confident, do whatever I'd like, have responsibility, dedication, put more effort into more stuff. For Sergeant and Colonel, have had major impacts in my life where um, I used to be really bad and they persistently try to persuade me and doing better stuff, try to be more motivated in coming to school. And I did slack off, but I've been trying and more than any teacher in Bogey, I'd say they help me out a lot. And that's the benefits of being an ROTC to me. Ooh. Hello, First Sergeant, hello, Colonel, hello. Sergeant Whitehead, I'm gonna miss y'all, man. It's gonna be a fun year next year, probably for y'all. I know this is my last year. It's gonna be crazy though, cause I'm about to graduate. I gotta go do what I gotta do. Hopefully, I enlist. Hopefully, I gotta prove my scores on that bad, cause I know Sergeant Major and First Sergeant were killing me about it. I'm talking about you better get your scores up, better study. Cause every time I came late, it was like First Sergeant come out of nowhere. Where you at, Jackson? Just waiting for me, posting like, hey, I just got here. He's my, you did a shave for uniform. I'm like, okay, first sergeant, just shh, shh. But first sergeant, gotta calm down on it, okay? Some kids actually can't shave nowadays. You know, they, they can't afford shavers or razor blades. Sergeant Major, make sure you hear everybody tell them, log it up. Colonel, I'm gonna miss you the most because I'm. it's kind of sad that, you know, you retiring. I'm not gonna be here to see you retire. But I'm gonna come back at least to see you, see you retire. I'll try to come back and visit and see what kind of kids y'all get next year. But hopefully, I don't end up in jail like an average black person. 
Just just on the real. Like I'm gonna be on the real on that one. But but, <laughs> but I'm gonna stay out of trouble and do what I gotta go do. So um big up, see y'all next year. See you. So, hi, um, I'm Cadet Captain Amanda Keshish, and I've been in RTC for four years now. And I originally joined because my brother was in it, and he said it was so much fun and all this stuff, so then I joined. And I uh, joined the drill team, the Raider team, uh, my freshman year, and then I stopped doing. Oh, yeah. So, okay, so I want to say a big thank you to First Sergeant for always pushing me, always making me do my best. Even though we didn't get along at times, you were always there for me, and thank you very much. And Sergeant Major, you're cool. Like you're like definitely one of the coolest people I've ever met in my life. You're so like awesome and great to talk to, you. and you were a great uh, drill team helper uh, or instructor, I guess. And um, I just we had so many funny memories, like Mayaka and all these different drill meets and stuff. And I'm gonna miss you all very much. And Colonel, you were always like a father to me, and it was like, thank you so much for everything that you've done for me. Giving me rides to school, like, I'm your riding boo, and all everything. And I'm going to miss you very much, and I'll come back and visit. So, thank you. Hey guys, I'm Sarah Laitlis. I am class of 2014. Woo -woo. I just want to say thank you to First Sergeant, Sergeant Major, and Colonel for all that you guys have done for me. You guys have motivated me. You guys have helped me go the right way in life, helped me set a nice path for myself. And if you guys hadn't, honestly, I wouldn't be where I am today. I'm 11th grade. I'm graduating early. I'm joining the U.S. Army. I have so many goals for myself that when I was a freshman, I didn't even see them possible. I just want to thank you guys so much for all you guys have done. Shout out to Raiders, Drill, all that. I love you guys so much, and I'm going to definitely be back to visit you. Now I had to do a little dance right now. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> I have to watch it though. You know that, right? You didn't hit record. Huh? Hi, I'm Brandon Mercado. I just joined ROTC my senior year. Uh, I wish I would have joined it my freshman year. There's a lot of girls. Uh, I learned a lot though, besides just the girls. Um, they have, you learn about leadership. That's the class I'm in. Um, and it just teaches you a lot of life skills other than just military things. But if you are looking to go into the military, it will teach you a lot of that things too. So. Yeah. How long is that to be? You guys cut all this out. My name is Brijana, um, senior, class 2014. I just recently joined ROTC second semester. And I didn't really get to experience anything yet, but now I met a lot of good people that want the best for me. And um, I want to say thank you to Sergeant Major because he really like pushes me and he always say like give me a high five and stuff. And it makes me feel really good. Um, my dog Brian still, you know, <laughs> that's my buddy in RTC. And um, I'm so excited for field day. That's all. Just like start where you I'll cut I'll cut every all these little things. Okay. So like the first time I ever came in this class was um sophomore year. I was at Northeast before and I got I got kicked out to be honest because of my grades. I came here I came I got this class 
they put me in this class because there was nothing else available. But when I got in this class, I, I liked it a lot because because they held me accountable for what like my parents weren't doing. And I actually got held accountable for my actions, if it was bad or good in between. Um, they also, like, honestly, another thing is, like, this is supposed to build leadership and everything. I didn't really get that characteristic, like, emphasized in, my, in myself. It was more confidence in my way because but when I came here, I was, I was shy. I was, like, the shyest kid anyone's ever met. Well, I mean, that's not true. I tried to fit in so bad here because I was the new kid. But when I got in this class, they my, my confidence skyrocketed. But then when I started playing football, too, it got even more. But, like, last year I went to military ball, and I went to start major, and I'm like, I don't know how to do this. I'm trying to ask. Hey, it's Gabby. Um, these past four years have been unforgettable. Colonel, you're the absolute sweetest man I've ever met and the wisest. First Sergeant, thank you for guiding me in the right direction and always pushing me in Raiders and giving me good advice. Sergeant Major, the first couple of weeks you were here, you were always running into me and you never spoke. Um, but you're like a father to me and I will definitely come back to visit the drill team because I love them all. Um, the three of you have like really made a big impact on my life, and I just want to thank you guys for everything you've done, and love you guys. Thank you. Hi guys, my name is Morgan Wynn. I've been in the program since my freshman year. I've enjoyed everything, every moment of it, especially when uh, First Sergeant and Colonel were just here, and then when Sergeant Major came, everything just got better. I was on every team that you could possibly think of, except for exhibition. I'm not very coordinated. Um, each one of them have helped develop who I am today. They've helped me through a lot of hard times that I went through, especially Sergeant Major and First Sergeant. I give them a lot of credit for that. They helped me get out of my shell that I was in. I used to be very shy, and now I'm more comfortable with who I am today, and I thank them for everything. When I graduate, I hope to come back and see them here still teaching, doing their thing and everything like that. You guys have great instructors and just take every benefit that you can get out of it. Hey guys, it's me, Kiana. Um, whew, being in JRTC for four years, it was a good experience. You guys helped me fix my attitude a lot because I had a bad, bad attitude and you guys helped me fix that. And you guys helped me prepare for college because I was not ready at all. And I just want to thank you guys for everything you've done for me. And love you guys. Bye. What's up, y'all? It's Sean. Um, I wasn't really about being an ROTC at first. I was pretty skeptical about it because I thought I was going to be in boot camp or something. I'm not about that. I thought I was going to be doing a whole bunch of push-ups and stuff, getting yelled at. No, nah, I wasn't really about that. But, um, yeah, I saw a whole bunch of pretty girls at first, and I was like, all right, I'll try it out. So my first year I did drill, always got in trouble. Got referrals after referral. Had detention all the time, always getting kicked out. So then I started tightening up, started doing drill, got better at it. And um, really, Colonel and First Sergeant helped me out a lot at first. But I was getting in trouble all the time, always getting suspended and stuff, and they helped me out a lot. And I appreciate that, you guys always there for me. Colonel, you always got my back since day one. First Sergeant, you was on my bad side at first, but I mean, you know, you grew on me, you helped me out a lot. Sergeant Major, when you came my sophomore year, you became my dog for real, you always had my back. When I was going through stuff, fights or anything problem wise you had me so i appreciate that a lot i love you guys you know you always have my back i always remember you guys when i come back I always say what up to y'all you know but thank you
in it all. But I don't want to press the button and then erase it. You know? But I want to see it before. Oh. Yeah. Because I know damn, I messed up at the end. I was, I was getting good at it and then I messed up at the end. So I want to see it. Is there anything you can cut out and then, you know, add on to it? Hey, this is Roma. Um, the past four years of RGC have been pretty great. Um, yeah. Oh my god. A lot of ha lots have happened. St uh, Raiders and drill, first two years, and then staff. Um, learning jumps is really crazy. I hate jumps a lot. Um, first sergeant has been really good to me. Colonel has been really great. Sergeant major is really great too. Made a lot of friends, like Jordan. <laughs> and um, I learned how to be a better person in general. Like without it, I'd probably be like a terrible person. So, yeah. It's going to stay with me for the rest of my life, definitely. Uh, how y'all doing? My name is JC Pedraza. I'm gonna let four. I've been in this program four years, and uh, at first, when I joined this program, I was kind of skeptical. I didn't know what to expect. I was like, man, I'm about to die and re be reborn into like a majestic butterfly. I didn't know what was gonna happen, but there were a lot of real pretty girls when I first got here, so I was like, I'll try it out, maybe see what's good, and then. I got on the Raider team my freshman year, and we started traveling and doing all these crazy things to my body, which I regret now, because I feel like an old man. Shout out to my little ones out there. Um, but I like to just thank Colonel for always being there for me and being like a father to me and a mentor and giving me advice when it came to my decision to join the military and helping me get my swole on all the time. And uh, I like to thank First Sergeant, First Sergeant for always being in my you know what, 24 seven, helping me out. You helped me out through a lot. Uh, we, we've had our moments and we've had funny moments. Like when we came back and you were going off on Jay, one of the greatest moments in my life, hilarious. Um, but thank you for always being there and mentoring me and make sure that I stayed on track and stayed semi, semi healthy. And, uh, I have to thank Sergeant Major being a big role model for the past two years since he's been here. Been a real, like a, a big pops to me. We had a, a lot of fun moments in staff and otherwise, well, I just want to thank all you guys. The shout out to my Raider team. We didn't win it, but at least we went to state in one district for the first time in seven years. And, uh, all right, that's it. Hi, I'm Kayla. My experience with ROTC has been fun. It's been helping me become more confident and able to speak in front of others. Sergeant Major, I want to say thank you for helping me and becoming my counselor and be, always being there for me. It's, first Sergeant, you've helped me learn so much about going into college and to the real world. And Colonel, I just love you. So I want to say thank you and I'll be back to visit. Hi, First Sergeant, Sergeant Major and Colonel. It's Alexis. I know I've only been in this program for three years, but ever since I've joined, I have definitely gained a lot of self-confidence that I wouldn't have had if I hadn't met the three of you. We have tons of memories together, from Raider competitions to 
stuff that happens in staff and all sorts of other things, but there's certain things I'll always remember. First Sergeant, I'll always remember waking up the day after the first night of summer camp and telling you that morning that I got stung by a scorpion the night before and seeing the shock on your face and then having you laugh. I'll also always remember us getting finally getting second place at Raiders for State. And Sergeant Major, I'll always remember our trip to Fort Benning and us doing the obstacle course and me wanting everybody to help me and then telling everybody to leave me alone so I could do it myself and then falling flat on my butt. And Colonel, I'll always remember going to State the first year I went and looking out the back window of the car and seeing you driving with the boys and you're trying to read your map and you were swerving back and forth. But it's not only those memories that matter. You guys have done so much more than provide us, all of us with things to remember and to look back on high school and see how great it is. This program has done wonders for everyone. You guys give up your time on the weekends to spend it with us when you don't have to, and that's something that I'll always be grateful for. I'll always, I'll, I'll always be grateful also for everything you guys have done to help me get to the Naval Academy. Without you guys, I don't know how I would have done it by myself. Um, it's one of those things that I know when I'm there and I'm having a rough day, I'm going to remember everybody who was at home that helped me get there and push on through to hopefully see you guys on graduation day. Anyway, thank you again, all three of you. Love you guys. Bye. <clears throat>
Jane Wimbush, and I am a senior. I'm graduating. I'm proud to say that. Uh, you know, it's been a long. Oh, here comes fresh Colonel, Colonel, hey Colonel. It's been a long journey. Uh, we'll talk about Colonel first. Let me guess. Uh, 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 yeah, I did Raiders for a good minute. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, sore. Uh, then I switched over to drill with Sergeant Major. And that was what I ended up staying with, pretty much. We went to, I was thrown in the States, surprisingly. I didn't think I was. Uh, but yeah, this program has been very influential in not only my college decision, but how far I'm actually making it in life. I will be going to North Dakota State University on a four-ride scholarship for football. And though Brian doesn't like that, I'm going anyway. I'll be playing safety. And Dr. Major always asks me how many touchdowns I'm going to score. Uh, it's going to be interceptions now. So, yeah. Uh, first Sergeant, always talking about rip your lips off and all that good stuff, but eh, I think that's quite possible, impossible. But knowing first art, he'll find a way to do it. So thank you guys, and I'll be coming back to visit when I have money or when Sergeant Major flies me down. Adios. Hi, it's Andy. So I could sit here and tell you for hours about how great this program has been in my life, but I'll keep it short and sweet. The three instructors, you three instructors, have changed my life. This program has absolutely changed my life. If I joined high school and didn't do this program, I have no idea where I would be right now. It has helped me so much, it's just, I can't even explain how much it has helped me. You do so much for this program and for everybody in it that I can't say anything but thank you. It's just so fantastic. It's so phenomenal, everything that you guys do. Um, it's been a long four years, and looking back on it, it feels so short. It has been a fantastic four years in this program. It is just every... I will always remember it. Always. Everything we have done here, I will always remember. It is so meaningful to me. You guys are so meaningful to me. First Sergeant Colonel and Sergeant Major, you guys have just changed my life. Seriously. It's, I don't even know what to say, it's so great. Thank you so much for everything that you've done. For everything you've done for me, for getting me through the four years and helping me plan my future. It's, I thank you so much. Um, I have had fantastic memories in this program. Funny memories, sad memories. It's, there's so many memories. And leaving this year, graduating and not being able to be in this program anymore is going to hurt big time. Um, it's just so great and it's the, one of the biggest stepping stones in my life um, and it's so great. Thank you so much for having me in it. Thank you so much for everything you do for me and for the program and for everybody. Thank you so, so much. I appreciate it so much and I will truly miss you guys. I love you guys. Hey, it's Gabby. What's up, it's Sean. We just wanted to say how proud we were of the drill team this year. We've done a really good job, and congratulations to Lacey and Freddie. Make us proud. Yeah, you know, I'm excited for next year because you guys did really good this year, and you guys have really good drill team captains, so I'm thinking you guys are going to do better than we did this year. Stop laughing. Anyway, but, you know, have fun. Always, you know, you don't, you don't want to be too serious all the time. You know, you have to have fun. Keep the shocker hand ready, and don't say nothing about it. It's staying in the video. Okay, well, we just wanted to say thank you to Sergeant Major. Thank you for everything you've done for the drill team. We know it's been a lot and hectic with everybody. And yeah, you helped me out a lot this year. I know I've always been goofy and stuff, you know. So you, you kept me straight. You know, I appreciate that. You're my dog. Um, we'll never forget the good times and the insiders we had on the car rides and the bus rides to the drill meets. And we'll definitely come back next year to visit. Funkin' in the truck, yeah. 
Okay. Well, thank you for everything. We love you. Deuces. From your two Raider team captains, we just wanted to say thank you. For Sergeant, you put so much time and effort into the both of us and into the Raider team that we couldn't thank you enough for it. First Sergeant, thank you for allowing both of us to be Raider team commanders this year. Without each other, I don't think we could have gotten as far as we did. We finally got second place in the state. And finally, first place at Rope Ridge. It has been a great year with great girls and a great way to end our senior year. So again, thank, thank you. you.